airplanes you'll see have some kind of wingtip device. The winglet is one of the most common of these, and you can see it on various airliners such as the A330 and A340. Some other kinds you'll see are the downwards turn winglets, scimitar winglets, horner wingtip, and wingtip fence. Wingtip devices are designed to reduce the drag induced by the wingtip. When an airplane wing produces lift, the airflow from the high pressure region under the wing circulates to the area of low pressure above. Now this causes a lot of inefficiency and drag. A winglet, for example, is meant to block the air from flowing over to the top of the wing and creating this inefficiency, essentially acting like a fence. But there's often a lot of debate over which wingtip device is actually the best, and this is particularly true for RC airplanes. Since they're so much smaller than something like an airliner, it's a lot harder to measure their overall efficiency and effectiveness. So why don't we try and gain at least some degree of knowledge over which wingtip device should be used in a model airplane. That'll be the subject of this video, and I'll be testing seven different types of wingtip device and attempting to measure their relative effectiveness in order to establish a base for if you want to design your own airplane and you want to know what kind of wingtip device to use. All right, so we're going to be measuring essentially the maximum velocity of the glider and the maximum height that we can get because that'll accurately tell us how much drag we're receiving from the airplane. This will be the baseline and the rest of the airplanes with the wing modified wing tips are going to be judged relative to this baseline. So wing tip device number two to test out is going to be these raked wing tips here. And by the way, if you're wondering, uh, these are just a little one 30 second inch balsa uh, sheets that I cut out and glued here. That's how we're doing this. So these are some very positive results. It looks like there is a little bit less drag uh, with these right wing tips. Right, next up, just the rectangular wing tips. Well, the max speed is definitely slower, but there are some positive results because there was a lot more lift with this wingtip device, but there was also more drag. Next up is the just standard winglets. Now, these shouldn't be treated as completely conclusive results because, you know, obviously like there's so many different types of winglets out there, so many different shapes you can make with, uh, with like something like this and different sizes and all that. So really this is just kind of a best, gu best guess estimate here. It wasn't quite as good as the raked wingtip one. Uh, I think it might have moved the line of drag upwards, which is making it pitch upwards. But it still looks like it did help out a little bit. Uh, it's a little bit faster than the no modification one, I think. Now we're gonna try the downwards turn wing. Well, it's kind of hard to test it because line of drag just keeps making it plummet to the ground, so I might just move the wings forward a little bit and test it that way. Uh, it will affect the results a bit, but I mean, oh well, it's the best we can do. Well, I don't know, these are just some incredibly poor results. So this next one is kind of a mix of both upwards and downwards, downwards turn winglets. It's kind of a wing to defense now. I mean, it looks the coolest, so that's already got that going for it. So for this last one, for this number seven, we've got 
this kind of bird feather mimicry here. I saw this uh, like NASA article a while back and they said it was supposedly highly efficient. Uh, so we'll test that out. I know that we're increasing the aspect ratio here. So I will take that into account in the results. Yeah, so there's some gain from it, uh, but it's not the most impressive. So it is somewhat unfortunate that we couldn't get any more conclusive results, but it does seem that the raked wingtip was the best in this case. I'm not sure why that is. Uh, it could have been because it increased the aspect ratio the most, uh, but it's going to need more testing to get a better, more definitive answer. But for now we can say that probably the raked wingtip is your best choice. Anyway, thank you for watching. Uh, please like and subscribe if you enjoyed the video, and until next time.